Hi, Assalamu Alaikum. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do this beautiful makeup look, which you can wear on any occasion, especially if it's a daytime occasion, like a like a party or an event, which is daytime. You can wear this, and it will look fabulous. Just change, and you can wear it on any color dress. It does not matter, honestly. Just change the lip color according to your dress and your preference and you'll be good to go. So let's see how do we get this beautiful look. For that, let's get on to our makeup chair. I've done my base, my foundation. I have done it with L'Oreal True Match Foundation and I'm in the shade 5D, which is golden sand. And I did my concealer with Makeup Revolution Concealer and I'm in the shade C10. Also this time I used a new primer which is from Essence which is My Skin Perfect. It's a tinted primer which is really very good. You guys should try it. And I have set my base with Airspun. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and just bronze my face. For that I'm going to use the Benefit palette and I'm going to use the Hula bronzer. I normally try and do it in a circular motion so that I can disperse the color very easily. Oh, I forgot. I've also done my eyebrows with the NYX brow pencil and set it with the essence. Blush, I'm going to use the same palette and use these two blushes together. And for highlighter, I'm going to apply the Kiko Milano highlighter in the shade Golden Wave. Now, let's move on to the eyes. For eyes, I'm going to prime my eyes with the MAC Paint Pot. And I'm just going to use my fingers for it. I'm going to slightly set it with a translucent powder so that I don't have any creases. So for today's look, I'm going to use the most beautiful palette, which is Huda Beauty palette, the Desert Dust palette. All right, and I'm going to start with a transition shade, which is going to be Okay, I'm going to start with this shade, which is Amber. With a fluffy blending brush. Let's dig in. Let's do the same thing on the other eye. My main focus is on the crease and little bit above the crease. So my transition... My transition shade is done. Now let's move on to deepening the crease. And for that, I'm going to use a little darker brown, which is... Uh, actually, I'm going to take saffron. Okay. With a small blending brush. Tap the excess. And keep this only in your crease. Start with outer corner and move slowly in in circular motions. Make sure you're covering the outer corner. Okay, let's do the same thing on the other eye and I'll be back. So I have deepened the crease enough. This is something that I want. You can go more deeper if you want. But uh, this is something that is fine with me. The next, the sh uh, next, the shade that we are going to use is retrograde, which is a little shimmery color. Little, no, it's a very beautiful color. Okay, and I'm going to place it first on the middle. And then slightly move in. It's a very mild shimmer, okay, and it's so soft and beautiful. Okay, 
I don't know if camera is doing justice and I'm sure most of you all have tried this palette. It is so beautiful. I'm gonna take this right till the end. Make sure you have enough on the lash line because that is the area which normally tends to fade away. Obviously, we're going to add some color to it, but just make sure you have enough. Ooh. I'll do the same thing on the other eye and I'll be back. So both my eyes are done with the glitter, I mean. Now for the lower lash line, I'm going to go and use saffron, okay, with a pencil brush. Start with the outer corner and then move in. Okay, you know what, I think I'm going to use the kajal and just tight line it. Okay, and I'm going to do the same thing here. Okay, now I'm going to go and use the soft brown color. So I'm taking the soft brown color, which is the saffron. And I'm kind of smudging the black, uh, black kajal pencil as well. You see the smokiness? Now let's do the same thing on the other eye. Alright, so this is how it looks. Now, um, I just feel I need to add little more glitter. So I'm going to take the uh, heavy glitter eyeliner, which is from Folklore. And I'm just going to add a little bit in the middle. Not too much because we don't want to go too heavy, but just a little bit. So I'm going to do the same thing. If you guys want to buy anything from Folklore, I have a discount code, which is in the description box. Okay, I will have to wait till it dries. The eyes are looking so beautiful. Now that it's dried, I'm gonna go and do a quick wing liner off camera and I'll be back with my Maybelline Hyper Easy Gel. <laughs> All right, I'll be back. So the wing is done. Now it's time for mascara. And for mascara, I'm using the NYX Worth the Hype Mascara. Now let's come to the lips. For lips, I'm going to use the Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, liquid lipstick, which is in color Soft Lilac. See how beautiful the shade is? So this is the completed look. wanted to show you in the sunlight so that you know how it looks in the daytime this is so beautiful i love the eyes i hope you like it thank you for watching thank you for supporting me and thank you once again for stopping by do check my social media especially instagram because there's a huge giveaway going on take care of yourself be good be home be safe and i love you all Mwah. Bye.